What's up, y'all? It's Julian here from Off the Box Pearl. Coming to you another video. Before we get started, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe. Also, leave comments at the bottom um, about the video, what you thought, if you liked it, what have you. Also, you can follow me on Instagram at Off the Block underscore Pearl. Again, that's Off the Block underscore Pearl. Now we're gonna be doing some custom masks. Um, customer, you know, they wanted to put their brand on masks. Um, you know, it's still mask season. Corona definitely ain't going nowhere, so you, you got to wear a mask everywhere you go. So, um, you know, that they wanted to brand their business with with with, with some masks, custom masks. So they reached out to me and I said, okay, I can knock them out. Um, it's just a quick uh, 20 mask order or something like that. Um, one thing about masks, you know, they're, they're, this is, I'm going to be doing cotton masks, so I'm going to be using uh, vinyl. Heat, heat transfer vinyl for these masks here. Um, the person they had the mask already. Y'all, I mean, I I have masks as well, but they had their own, which made it even easier for me because they already had them. Um, so being as though it, it, it's not a big design, of course, because it's going on masks. This is the design. More to come. I did design this for 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 the customer maybe a year ago or something like that for their clothing brand that that they have out. Um, uh, so, you know, one thing about doing masks, it's, it's, it's easy, it's quick. Um, one thing I love about it, one thing I do like, um, the, the scrap vinyl that we all have, um, well, at least you should have because you shouldn't throw no vinyl away. Um, it, it comes in handy, you know, like it, it really comes in handy at this, at times like this. Um, I got, I got piles of, of, of. Of, of scrap vinyl everywhere i got uh i have a, a shelf where it's color coded stuff like that um so it always comes in handy whenever i'm doing like maybe one two three masks something like that something small but something like this 20 20 masks it's not to me it's not a lot it's not it's not overwhelming nothing like that it was easy to just cut one sheet of vinyl and put them all on that one sheet and then cut them and, and then, you know, cut it. Uh, my, my cutter just actually finished cutting the second batch. This is a quick 10 here. Um, so I'm gonna just, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna press some up uh, for this video. Um, I'm actually gonna be using my hat press to do it uh, because of the, how it, how it sits up and how the, how the mask goes on. It, it goes on it nice and tight on there. So that's what, that's how I'm gonna do that. Um, like I say, mass, mass. When it first, you know, all y'all know, like when mass first started out, you could sell mass probably fifteen, twenty dollars custom mass when it first, when this first, when the pandemic first happened. Now, I feel like now everybody does mass. Um, people make them, things like that. Um, you know, you can you can order them. Different, you can do different things with mass. Uh, but now. Um, I just feel like the demand has has went down a little bit, because um, at first, like I said, I was I was booming on masks at, in the beginning, um, but you know it slowed down just like anything. It can slow down, but um, with with that being the case, you know here it is. I got a twenty mass order, so we're gonna go ahead and knock that out. Um, uh, and being as though um, I didn't I didn't use a lot of vinyl, I, you know it didn't take me. A, no no time to, to to weed this out or anything like that i mean this is this is really simple like this is probably gonna take me maybe 15 minutes and i'm finished you know to be honest now i mean 15 minutes after the after it's finished cutting and i weeded it you know weeding it up probably only took me five minutes uh the cut time was probably the longest maybe seven minutes maybe um so but in, in, either way, I was sitting down watching TV while I was cutting, and then I was watching TV while I'm weeding it. So truthfully, I'm really not even paying attention to the time because I had time to do it. Like I had, I don't have to. It's not like this needs to be done right now. I could have waited till tomorrow to do it. I could have just prepped everything and then pressed it tomorrow. But I say, hey, why not? Let's do a video on it. I haven't did a mass video. Um, I also do sublimation mass. Now that's mass that I love to do because it's really no work involved to be honest. Once you got your artwork done, um, it's just pretty much send it to to my sawgrass printer, uh, sublimation printer, and put the mask on, line it up, press it down on my um, on my heat press, 
and I could do probably maybe um, on my 16 by 20 heat press, I could probably put at least like uh, maybe, uh, I guess maybe five masks at a time on there. So that that makes it that makes it easy and fast as well. And it's just, you know, 30 second press at 400 degrees for a sublimation mask. Um, I will do a I will do another video doing sublimation mass as well, probably following this video. Um, so stay tuned for that. Um, I got a visitor here, y'all. Y'all want to see? Let me show y'all my visitor. Come here, come here, son. I got my visitor, y'all. He he always want to be involved. You know what I mean? He got a new haircut, y'all. Look, he got a mohawk. <laughs> yeah, he got a mohawk. I'm like a jack of all trades when it comes to my hands. You know, I can cut hair. Like, my kids have never been to a barbershop because I cut their hair. Ain't that right, son? Mm -hmm. Who cut your hair? Yeah. Right. So, you know, haircuts is a lot of money nowadays. Y'all probably always say, why you always got a hat on? Because I don't feel like cutting my hair. <laughs> I'm letting it grow, actually, but I just don't feel like cutting it right now. So, I just keep a hat on. But, any of it, we're going to get right into this video. We're going to get right into this video. Let me uh move my... My camera down onto the the hat press. So as y'all can see, it's right on. Okay, bam. There we go. So here's the mask. I put the mask right over top of this. And oh, stop, stop. Also, also, y'all, I did um I did spray this off so y'all know, like disinfectant spray. Um, so and I don't have corona, so everything is alright anyway. Uh, so we're just gonna line this up on here like that. We're gonna line this up on here like this. And once that's lined up on there, I just want y'all to be able to see it even closer. Uh, right there. So once we put that on there, we line it up, and we just go ahead and press it down. 15 seconds. I think my hat press is on like 350 or something like that. For some like this, this, and this is an Amazon hat press. Like I had it for probably like three years now. Hasn't failed me yet. I do have another hat press. I just don't use it. This one works fine for me. Um, I've done many hat jobs with this press, so I, I am gonna press it just one more time, simply because the design is a little bit bigger than the actual size of the the heat plate, just to make sure everything gets an even, even press and an even temp on there and i think we are done with this so we just hot press that off and this, this is just regular regular vinyl um so as y'all can see that is finished here's the finished product on the mask lined up nice it'll go right on the face i'm not gonna put it on because this is mine um and that's it. Um, and I'm going to just sit here and I'm going to finish the rest of these. Uh, now I have 18 masks left uh, because that wasn't the first one. I always do a, a test run for, for, the, for one first to make sure it lines up right, make sure it's right. Um, and that's it. So hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video. Y'all learn. Y'all learn um, how to do masks. Um, uh, you can press them on, a, on on your regular heat press. You don't have to have a, a hat press to press them. It, for me, it's just easy to do it this way. I can do it on my heat press. I probably can knock out maybe. I can probably line up maybe like eight at a time on my on my 16 by 20 hat press. I mean heat press and knock them out like that. But I don't have anything to do right now. And and, and I just like I want to get a perfect uh perfect press on each individual mask so it's no issues, no no things like that. So that's pretty much it. So you got something you want to tell them? No. Come on. No. Come on, tell them what they gotta do. No. Come here. No. Come on, come here, hurry up. We rolling. Come on. Do you wanna come or not? What do I have to say? Come here. Like Look, tell them what to say. Tell them what they say in all like tell them what they say in all the YouTubes. Make them like subscribe to the channel. Don't talk like that. Talk like a big like you're not a baby. Come on, man. Mm. Tell them what to say. Tell them what to do. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button, y'all. So, hope y'all enjoyed it. Hope y'all like the guests again. Thank y'all. Peace out.